Jim Vanamere looking for a tip in front, and that's well blocked by Billingsley. Robert Lagovitz tries to feed that through. Kyle Baum blocks the pass going across and feeds it to the right side for Rollerford. Rollerford, a quick wrist shot. Good save down low by Garnett. Garside keeps it in. Help. Tipped in front. A quick reaction. The puck breaks free and an early whistle from Andrew Dalton. But it took a big ricochet. That was a good save by Garnett. Yeah, that took a really funny hop. I don't know that he actually saw that. I think it just hits him. He's kind of looking the other way. No one really expected that puck to... Uh, to come deflecting the way it did, but he's able to uh, he's able to get a piece of it and and uh, got a, in my opinion, a pretty fortunate whistle. I thought Andy Dalton kind of had the the vision that we had, and you could see the puck sitting there that he never had it. But either way, uh, nice save. Ex Panthers or coach doing a good job in in, uh, in Germany at the minute. He's coaching Steve Salviano, I believe this year. Isn't he? he is, yeah. Here comes Belfast once again over the line there, and it says a chance to the back door. What a finish from Kyle Bond! Top shelf, great pass from Darcy Murphy. Chance one nil up. Great job on the rush there. This line, uh, they get across the blue line. Rutherford's able to find uh, Darcy Murphy. Makes a great pass over to Kyle Bond, and he makes no mistake going up top, up upstairs on uh, Michael Garnett. But heck of a play by this line to create. Uh, Create something off the rush coming in here, and uh, the Giants take the early lead. Even Schneid goal, Rutherford inside to Murphy, backhand pass, and a one-timer. What a finish from Kyle Bond. Giants won, Panthers nil. Bringing all these new composites, Kevlar shafts, and everything, and nothing like the old Titan 2020, <laughs> is there? <laughs> they certainly don't last the way the old no, ones did. No, they don't. They certainly don't. Shot from Dessen, kept in front. Justin Jonner looks if like he's going to take the accolades from that one. But a shot from Vandermeer from the point. The Giants 2-0 up. Yeah, you know, all this starts. The Giants enforce the icing up before that. They win the faceoff. Back to Vandermeer. He gets the shot through, and it looks like Dustin Jonner gets the tip going to the net in front. And uh, the Giants are up two, up two here. Tether to the blue line. Stevie Lee cross to Hughes. Hughes winds up. Gets the shot away. It took a deflection. And the Panthers have got to go back. Yeah, nice movement by the Panthers. They get it back up and over, and then the shot comes through traffic. It looks like there's people standing right in front of uh, Tyler Beskrani, and it seems like he uh, he just didn't see it, and I think it beat him five hole to uh, cut this lead in half. Hughes with the shot. I'm pretty sure it took a deflection in front there, but Hughes looks like he's going to get the accolades from that one. The assist should go to Stevie Lee and Pether. Well, we'll get confirmation that. The score now, 2-1. It was definitely, uh, I think it was definitely Stevie Lee sending it across the blue line. Good goal line. Ryan behind that at a best girl. He spins, gets a shot away, and it's tipped in front. And they've tied things up. And again, the Nottingham Panthers make it 2-2. Yeah, you know, obviously this is really good work here by the, uh, the Nottingham forwards. Uh, battling the puck out, protecting that puck, coming around the net. Throws it in front, and I'm not sure. Uh, looks like uh, Stewart was able to... Uh, uh, Guptil here, he just comes around, he makes a nice move, shields the puck, is able to throw it at the net, and uh, Stewart gets gets himself wide open for a uh, tip in front. Darcy Murphy to the red line, feeds it inside for Rutherford, it's going to be onside, I think that's a little bit lucky there, but the Giants are capitalizing on that, and Kyle Bond gets a second goal in the game, the Panthers bench are absolutely incensed. Yeah, it's certainly a close play at the blue line, but the Giants do a good job finishing it off. Kyle Bond with his second of the game. Nice play by, uh, I think it was Darcy Murphy who passed it over to him. Or uh, David Rutherford, I'm sorry. Great shot here by Bond to beat Garnett short side. Obviously, there's some controversy. The Panthers really felt that it was offside on the play, but I almost felt like their players let up a little bit thinking it was offside. And when it wasn't called, Bond was able to get a little extra room to, uh, to put that one in short side. But either way, the Giants are back on top now and what we've had it. You know, a wild first period here with five goals, and there's still almost six minutes to play. Well, David Roller for the second helper of the game. Kyle Baum with the second goal of the game. And Darcy Murphy with his second helper of the game. This line's been put together for the first time today, and that's a giveaway there and a chance for the chance here. Kyle Baum on the right side. Baum into the zone, feeds it across. Lovely play by Darcy Murphy! And not even the goal before that has been announced. Darcy Murphy puts a chance, fourth goal on the board. What a play here. The Giants create the two-on-one, uh, and they come down. Darcy Murphy's able to get the puck, come across the crease. He's able to put it in behind uh, Michael Garnett for a 4-2 for a lead. Great pass across by Bond. 
Darcy Murphy's able to collect it, come back across. Garnett tries to poke check it, and, and Murph's able to put it in. So great job on their own blue line to call, create that two-on-one. The defenseman got caught outside the dots, tried to pinch up, and uh, and he was left in the dust. And and now it's a uh, a 4-2 lead. So sir, it goes back to the, it goes back to the John zone. Pether let yeah. that puck go past him. Kyle Vaughn picked it up. I mean, and, I think Pether could have caught that along the wall. Yeah, and I, I think the defenseman there got caught. Uh, he got caught sleeping a little bit, got outside the dots, tried to pinch up a little bit, and all of a sudden it was a two-on-one. And when you've got guys with speed like Darcy Murphy, you really have to be aware as a, as a defenseman that uh, uh, you don't give them too much time because you're not going to catch them. They get by you. Smothering knife. Backdoor play. What a save from Garnett. That's Fantastic a, save. That's a huge save by Michael Garnett. While they're still announcing the other goal, certainly the, uh, he, he doesn't want his team to go down three there. So an incredible save there by Garnett to keep it a two-goal lead. Comes off a stick there in front, and Chris Stewart tries to start the transition for the Panthers going forward. Stewart picks it up, gets to the top of the circle. He's got a man inside, and they finished it off. 11 seconds to go in the period, and we're back to 4-3. Yeah, you know, the Panthers are able to kind of battle there at center ice. They're able to create a two-on-one and a really nice play by uh, by the by the guys coming across the line, able to find Robert Farmer there on the back door for, for a pretty easy uh, tap-in goal behind Tyler Beskarani. So a bit, just a bit of battle there at center ice. Perlini. Those to get it out front. The Giants managed to get a hold of it on the sand at 200 feet. Yeah, that's a good kill by the Giants, managing to somehow keep the puck out of their own net. Nice block by Kevin Rain, but that's quality move, puck movement by the uh, Panthers' uh, power play unit. Certainly don't want to give them too many opportunities today to go out there because they're moving the puck really well. Lovely pass through the middle. Chris Stewartson behind the defense. Shot coming in. Big save by Pesco. Just as I was saying, that is a great, uh, great breakout pass to find Stewart in behind the defenders. and. Tries to go high over the glove of Besco, but Besco is able to uh, to glove it down. But you know, certainly don't want to be giving a player of Stewart's uh, ability too many breakaways. And Stewart dying into the circle, tries to cut to the front, looks to lose control of that one. They're in the last couple of seconds here. Is the chance back to five on five? They go Z to Z from the Panthers though. And look, corner Stewart's in the high slot, gets it out front, tries to go back to our play, and they've not they added up the four four. And again, another heads up play by Chris Stewart. You know, that's some. Extremely high quality puck movement by the Panthers. They were able to bring it from the, it goes all the way around, up the, up and across the blue line down. They hit Stewart in the slot and he's able to give it back door for an easy, uh, an easy finish there for the, uh, for the Nottingham Panthers to, uh, to tie this game up at four. So really high quality puck movement. Uh, and again, you see the easy finish there off a great pass by Chris Stewart, but. Kovacs on the half wall. Tries a little sauce pass in, gets a second attempt at that one. Seven seconds to go, Chris Stewart with a shot, block, and another good save from Beskarwani. We're back to five on five, but again, another good penalty kill from the chance, but there's a chance here right on the doorstep. Chance coming up, what a save from Besco. Your goaltender needs to be your best penalty killer, and he's come up with a two brilliant yeah. saves in that shift. And Jordan Smotherman sends it off the wall, back to Vandermeer. He's looking for a shot, good save, a rebound effort, second chance for Kyle Bond. There's gonna be a penalty in the play here. But that was a glorious chance for Kyle Bond to set the Giants on the fifth goal of the game. Tommy Hughes and Hughes battling in behind there with his teammate Guy Lepine. Murphy sends it down low for Rutherford. Little give and go from Kyle Bond. Rutherford off the wall. Two Bond. Bond behind the back. Loves a shot there. Coming in to get the goal. Dustin Johnner driving the net after a great initial save from Garnett. And a power play marker with 41 seconds gone in the third. 5-4 Giants. Nice puck movement there by the Giants. Rutherford to Bond. He's able to spin. He gets a good quality shot. Garnett was able to keep it out. And I'm not sure if it was Garnett or the defenseman that whacked it away, but right onto the stick of Dustin John, or he's able to find the back of the net to put, give the Giants a 5-4 lead. It was actually hit back into the, the crease area by the glove of Guy Lapine. Kyle Bond, he's tied up by... Stevie Lee, round behind for Henderson, stripped of the puck by Darcy Murphy. Murphy looking for a bit of control here. Bolduc, Santa gets stuck. What a move by Darcy Murphy, backdoor play. Chance for the Giants, it's right into the blue paint. There's a penalty in the play. What a save from Michael Garnett. And the whistle blows. A glorious chance for the Giants. What a wild sequence of events there. Uh, Panthers are going to be short-handed here, but I think their player thought that he got high-sticked. Either way, Darcy Murphy fought through all kinds of traffic, gets it to Blair Riley, who's 
able to find, I think, Kyle Bond maybe in that. He turns and fires, and Michael Garnett from his laying on his side is able to reach up and make a spectacular save to keep it a one-goal hockey game. Well, the penalty door is still open here. Garnett getting a bit of attention with uh, saying about his glove or his blocker, I believe. Saying the official about something. And he's going for a few repairs on the bench. There was a lot happening there. A couple guys thought that they were felt they were fouled and there should have been a penalty, but uh, either way, the, the, uh, the Panthers are going to end up shorthanded, but Kyle Bond with a spectacular opportunity to make this a two-goal hockey game, and Michael Garnett is able to reach up from his, as I said, he was laying on his side, was able to reach up and make that save. Great stick there by Chris Higgins. He just took it off the tape of Chris Stewart. He was winding up. There's a chance for the chance. He's in behind. Shot coming in. Dustin Jonner gets the hurry. Jonner, three goals on the night. Chance, 6-4. Great goal by Dustin Jonner. He's able to chase that one down, and he's able to beat Garnett for his third goal of the game. We've been singing Chris Stewart's praises all night, but he tries to toe drag that one just outside the blue line. It gets, punched, it gets poked off his stick, and Jonner chases it down and uh, gives the Giants a two-goal lead. That lovely play again by the Panthers through the blue paint, and they managed to get that the length of the ice. It's going to go the whole way, too, oh. and just misses the post. That's two opportunities. Merrily, third time lucky. A long shift. You can see just John Rowe. dead on his feet there. Top of the slot gets it inside. Shot coming in, and they've got their fifth goal. 1.22 to go, it's now 6-5. Yeah, you know, great work there by the Panthers. A couple tired players out on the ice for both teams. They were just working hard, get that puck back. They're able to find the man wide open in the slot, and he's able to beat Tyler Beskarani to make it a one-goal game with 1.22 to play. Giants had a couple chances at the empty net, weren't able to capitalize. And then the Panthers here just working hard. They get a man wide open in the slot, and he's able to beat the goalie and, and make it a 6-5 uh, game with 1.22 to go. Perlini at 48, 38. As you say, they had the extra skater on there. Michael Garnett is now back in the net. The Giants had two chances at the empty net. There's a bouncing puck. Here comes Darcy Murphy. Murphy, round one, feeds it inside. Dark Kyle Bond. Kyle Bond with the hat trick! Kyle Bond with the hat trick! The Giants get their seventh goal of the game. Great job by Darcy Murphy there. He's able to shake, I think it was John Rowe, skates forward at him to try to stop the play from coming out of the zone. And he dishes it across to Kyle Bond and makes a nice move around Pither and puts it in the wide open cage to have our second hat trick of the evening and make it a 6-5 game and seal this one for the Giants. Two hat tricks in one game. I have to get David McJumpsy to hunt out that one to see when the last time that's happened. But an unselfish play by Darcy Murphy. Feeds it inside to his good buddy, Kyle Bond and Bond. Gets his hat trick with 103 to go in the game. You know, the Giants win the all important draw there, and then Darcy Murphy does the hard work bringing it out of the zone. He avoids one uh, one, uh, one Panthers defender and then dishes it off to his line mate. There's another chance. Bond with another shot. Han cut the goaltender. Gets it out front. Smotherman gets his first goal as a Giant. 8 4. I thought it was Kyle Bond. It's actually Blair Riley with a shot. Unselfish play. And Smotherman gets his first goal. Yeah, you know, you played all the way to the end. That's Blair Riley just working hard. Sean Lai's the captain, pokes it through there, and he brings it across, and he's able to find Jordan Smotherman, who gets a nice, uh, he picks up his own rebound, finds Smotherman for probably one of the easiest goals he'll score all year. It's into the wide open net, so certainly great for him to uh, get a goal in his debut, and uh, credit to the Giants for continuing to work hard uh, after they pretty much sealed this game.